Well, a very good evening to you as you join us for tonight's live game. Unfortunately, our weather forecast is somewhat less than promising. We're told to expect intermittent spells of heavy rain, which might very well impact on the quality of the football later. It'll certainly add a new dimension, especially for those players who like to keep hold of the ball. A few anxious faces, hoping it will all somehow stay away. But I have to tell you that, we are told, is an extremely unlikely scenario. Olympico, a venue that has an old-school feel about it. The action has already started. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Gareth Bale, for me, has got to be the, the standout man. Oh, shooting chance! Big moment! Massive goal! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. That was a given, it always was. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement, and when all of that is synchronised with the right pass, that's what happens. Italy take the early advantage. Chiellini. Just starting to get the first signs of rain here. Spinazzola drives it forward. Jorginho. And it's Ferrati. Over to the left. Up for the header! Good delivery, no joy. Wales can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Fired in. And he's there to clear it. Himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Marco Verratti. Chiesa. Chart Insignia! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. It's a good finish, the odds were against him, little matter. Immobile really showed good strength there, held his man off, didn't let himself get bullied, and got his effort away. Maintained control. Italy got themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Can't get the better of his opposite number. Cheers, up. Chiellini. Spinazzola. Marco Verratti. Jorginho. And it's played forward. And that'll be the last act 
of the first half. Some first half thoughts? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why do them from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Italy ahead 2 0, and they are looking good. And we're already back on the way here. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And that's offside, yes, it is. Clears it out of harm's way. Marco Verratti. Now it's Insigne. Ramsey. Plays it out to the wing. Chiesa absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition. And I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Davis. Wales can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. And we're not going to make any further progress now. And here's Immobile, just brushed off the ball there. Oh, they can break here. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Marco Verratti. Someone looks like he's in need of protection here. Yeah, and having notched the goal already, Peter, he's not going to be allowed to run off the shoulder as, as much as he'll want. Now it's Immobile, out to the left it goes, gets away from his opponent, Lorenzo Insigne, Immobile hits it! Oh, it looked like 3-0 for sure. Well, that ought to have wrapped it up, Peter, you may well regret that, you know. Jorginho, and here's Insigne, oh, good take in a good area, and he heaves it forward. Yeah, it's about time I think we saw some activity from the bench, but it's it's debatable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's it's pretty late. And here's Immobile. Chiesa has a pop. <laughs> the changes then in quick succession. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. And it's Verratti. Marco Verratti. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Well, if he truly fancies his chances from here, he's going to need the best of the best. Oh, it's a beauty! A finish right from the top draw! And they are cruising away! And he's produced a beauty! Italy take it. So that's it, it is all over. Italy have won big and in style. Everything went for them, their four opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. Could you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Yeah, we knew there was a sizeable gap in the quality of both squads and, and the story was told in predictable fashion. So many thanks to Jim Beglin, that's all we have time for. Good evening to you.